Hey guys, so what's up everyone? Kate, I'm back with another video. Today, I'm going to share to you something serious, okay? It's typhoon season here in Japan. So, I want to share to you this video that will help you, okay? That will help you be prepared in this season. But not just here in Japan, but to you guys all over the world, to have your emergency go bag already prepare it now okay i prepared it like it's not just you know for just one day like i just you know uh, collect things and buy things i prepared it like for a couple of months ago yeah and i want you to do the same well okay it's not a mu must but there's nothing wrong with being prepared guys okay so today I'm going to share to you what's inside it. Okay, what's not inside it too. <laughs> yeah. Okay. So let's get into this bag. Yeah. So now let's get started with what I'm going to share to you or how or what's inside or what I prepare for my emergency go bag. Okay, first you need to have your helmet. Okay, guys, it's to protect your head from falling debris. Okay. You can buy this in your hardware. Just your simple hard hat, okay? Next is, what do you have here is my headlight, okay? Headlight, okay? So that I can use, so I have free hands whenever I do something, I'll have a light, okay? In the dark, okay? Next is, so let me just uh, share to you my bag. It is, oh, okay. My emergency go bag weighs around 6 kilograms. Yeah, I know it's kind of heavy, but yeah, I think yeah, when you're in an emergency, you kind of, you know, it doesn't really matter anymore how how heavy your bag is, right? Okay, so first of all, this is my bag. This is a hiking bag. It's lightweight and waterproof. So I just, uh, you know, added some little feature. I just customized a little I placed this low in the dark tape so how yeah let's yeah have an experiment and how what is the okay so yeah, I just turned off my ring light and I just closed the door my little room and then as you can see just the tape okay so whenever there whenever it happen it happens in you know at night I can just I I'll know where my bag is so you can buy this tape in uh, I don't know where actually I bought this in a 100 yen shop okay so yep that's it for the bag okay let's go with the stuffs inside okay first is the lower the lower pocket what they have here is plastic cellophane where you can use as a storage and yeah they said you can use this for socks too okay then what they have here is an emergency or uh, no not emergency it's a survival tool okay swiss knife yep okay you can buy this in amazon i bought this from amazon okay next is let's go here they have here is a, our batteries for my headlight okay this is the only yeah these are the only this is the only batteries i have okay because i just need batteries for my headlight okay next is i have here some uh paper stuffs like my birth certificate a picture and an extra atm card okay next is just small stuffs like uh, hair ties, band-aid, and a whistle. Guys, you need to have a whistle because sound travels faster than light if I'm not mistaken. Okay. Next is paper and pen and a marker. Then, your emergency money. Okay. You need to have this in, you know, small. You need to have this in change, okay? In coins, okay? Not bills, guys, okay? Yeah, I think that's it for this pocket. Let's go here. I have here is a two meter long rope. Okay. 
Next, I have this uh, waterproof phone case. Then, this is a mini toilet in case there's, you know, emergency and you can't use the bathroom in your in an emergency in your emergency evacuation center. Next is this emergency blanket. Okay, that's that. Okay. Then we let's go over here. Okay, the, yeah, here. The biggest the biggest portion. Okay guys. Oh, oh my gosh. So I actually separated uh, or actually store this in a ziplock for you know so that I can find things easy and I can you know yes yeah, store things yeah it's organized I think if it's like this okay I yeah I also recommend you to use your ziplock plastic bag so that it won't get wet and yeah like that so this is my emergency food so yeah, color curry made expires like a year and yeah, this one to a year but I have this food, this, yeah, really long, uh, long shelf life, long shelf food, huh? shelf long. Okay, I don't know the term, guys, but it will expire on 2025, okay? Yep, okay, and all you just need is uh, water. And then I have this paper cup inside, yeah, because cup takes space, actual cup takes space, so it's good to have your paper cup okay then i have this socks that yeah i can't sleep without this okay thank you then i have this power bank cables charger adapter for adapter for my yeah adapter, so that i can charge i think you yeah, yeah yeah okay yeah power bank adapter and cables for my power bank and uh in my phone and i i why do i have yeah and a charger for my flashlight. Next, I have this first aid kit. So I also customize what's inside this. But let me just do a quick review. I have triangular bandage, this medicine for cause and band-aids and some stuff used for your yeah, wounds to treat your wounds. And then I have also I also have whistle here. Yeah. Okay, so you can buy your own, you can customize your own first aid kit, guys, depending on what you need. Don't forget your own medicine, guys. Well, I don't have my medicine or like my maintenance, but if you have it, guys, please do not forget to put it in your emergency go bag, okay? Okay, next is let's go with the personal hygiene. My personal hygiene stuff. So, what I have here is dry shampoo, wet tissue. Mouth wash, uh, toothbrush and toothpaste, sanitary napkins, and paper cups, and uh, yeah, that's it. Okay. Then I have this one set of clothes too, and I have this quick dry towel. Yeah, I bought this from Amazon too. Quick dry towel. Okay. Then I also recommend that kind of towel because. Yeah, like it's kind, it's it's it does it didn't take too much space. It's a towel, by the way. It didn't too much. It didn't take too much of your space, and it's quick dry. So it's really good for emergencies. Okay. Next is, I have raincoat. I have this heat pad and gloves, and a pair of gloves. Next is, I have this newspaper and some documents. Okay, do not forget your documents, guys because yeah it's something that you need uh, i think yeah it's documents are important part of your life okay so don't forget to have it, to to put it in your emergency bag next what you have is a yeah, mask and then salon pass why do i have that i'm not sure why next i have this water do not forget your water guys so i think this is the heaviest of all but it's the, the it's yeah okay water it's what you really need okay your water so i just have this two liter water for myself okay if you have your family you can add up you can add more and if yeah you can actually add 
Uh, I don't know, depending on what you want, okay? But yeah, I just have this two liter water. Then last but not the least, no, not just last, but okay. I have this uh, candle in a match, okay? In case, yeah, my source of light, like my headlight and my flashlight will work. In my phone, I have an extra, you know, light. But yeah, be careful if you want to use a candle, okay? Next. Last but not definitely not the least is my flashlight. So this is not, yeah, this is not. Uh, this is a solar energy, solar powered flashlight, guys. So it doesn't have a battery. So I just need to charge it or solar power charge. Oh my crap. Okay. So yeah, I just wanna you know show you how it yeah goes. Like, just yeah light one then dimmer and then this is blinking careful with your eyes the blinking okay and then there's this you know if you want if you press this long have this light and then there's this emergency or sos light and then yep off there you go and then it has a built-in hammer because this flashlight is actually used for cars when you get trapped and you can just break the glass the window glass okay then it has you know the blade a blade for a seat belt okay and then it has okay so yeah it has also a magnet key then it's our power and it has a compass then last it has a boozer So yeah, I like this. So you can buy yours too if you want this one because I do not, I suggest or yeah, I recommend to have a solar power flashlight because batteries, yeah, add up weight to your bag. So that's it for all the things that I have, I guess. And last, definitely, definitely not the least. Don't forget to, you know, list the things that has expiry dates in just a piece of paper. Because, you know, if you just, you know, find things, oh, if you want to check for, yeah, you can just, yeah, look at this paper and, yeah, you'll notice that what are, you'll see what you need to, you know, replace and stuff like that. So, yeah, just write a piece of paper and then just, you know, stick it outside your bag. And this is my bag, it's really light. So uh, yeah, I guess that's it for my video, guys. Thank you so much for listening. Thank you so much for going this far. Thank you so much for finishing this. I hope that it helped you. I hope that you'll prepare your own, guys. There's really nothing wrong with preparation, guys. And uh, yeah, I hope to see you in the next video. So yeah, and don't forget to, you know, comments if you have some su suggestions or recommendations. Don't just... Yeah, just comment below and yeah, I'm happy to share these things to you guys. Yeah, see you in my next video. Bye!